This is like a classic anti-hero movie. You saw it when it came out? It's so good. I wish my high school experience was more like this. <laughs> Much tamer. <laughs> I'm Belmont Camelli. And I'm Emma Passero. We star in the new Netflix movie, Along for the Ride, and this is our bucket of movies. <laughs> Jaws. Great soundtrack. We're gonna need a Spielberg boat. being amazing. Yeah. Very scary. It took me a long time to have the courage to watch this movie. Really? I love the ocean and I love swimming in the ocean. And I knew that once I watched this, that would be a very different experience. You know what? Jaws gives sharks a bad rap. Does it? Love this movie. It's great. <sighs> this movie. Call me by your name. This movie is just so poetic. Oh yeah. The last shot of this film is one of my favorite closings to any movie. Mm -hmm. Timothy's character's just sitting in the fire and they roll credits over him. Yeah. And they like play that whole song. I mean, that movie, it just makes you feel so many different things. And I love that it's set in Italy. Oh, it's gorgeous. And the soundtrack, I think it's mostly Sufjan Stevens. You kind of feel atmospherically like you're in Italy in the summer. Yeah. There's no love like the love in Call Me By Your Name. Greece. Oh. Travolta. So good. Wonderful musical. There was a summer where my sister watched this movie uh, no less than 10 times. And I was there for, you know, most of them. I've been in a production of that musical twice. The first really? time I was eight years old. And the second time I was in high school. Which performance did you think was better? I mean, in third grade, I just had like a lot of moxie and gumption. And I, I was just it. like, it was like my first time on stage. And I was like, yeah. And I was Patty Simcox, the student yeah. council president. And the second time I was Frenchie, which was cool because I got to wear fun wigs. Yeah. I love that movie. I love wigs. <laughs> you were here first. <laughs> Oh, American Pie. A staple, a classic. This is a staple, this is a classic. It's like immortalized, kind of. Oh yeah, I wish my high school experience was more like this. <laughs> it wasn't? No! <laughs> <laughs> Little Miss Sunshine. This is a great movie. I haven't seen it. Oh, really? I haven't. Gosh, I haven't seen it since it came out. There's that great scene where Abigail Breslin is doing like a performance and she's crawling. I just have that image burned in my brain. But oh, we can watch it together. Oh, I just rewatched this. Almost Famous. Do you like that movie? This movie, have you seen it? Uh-uh. Oh my God. This has the best soundtrack of any movie ever made. It follows a band in the 70s and this young boy who's going with them on tour. I probably watched that movie when I was like eight or nine with my dad. We bond over music and he was sort of like, this is a movie with yeah. music you should know. There's like a big party scene where he's standing at the top of a building and then he says, I am a golden god, right? <laughs> and I'm on drugs. <laughs> and then he jumps in the water. Really? You would love it. All right, well, I'll watch it. Okay. <laughs> Next. My best friend's wedding. Sweet Dermot. Dermot Mulroney. Oh, so handsome, so talented. I hadn't seen this until I, I met Dermot, and then of course I watched it, and he is exceptional. He really is. He's one of those actors where when I was in a scene with him, I would be so lost in his performance because it was so good that I would forget my lines. He and a lot it, of stories. So many stories. Yeah. Oh, it was just a dream. Hearing about shooting my best friend's wedding and everything. He really <laughs> is someone who can and will talk to everybody on set and yeah. become friends with every single person he meets. Oh yeah. He's wonderful. Point Break. Now this is a movie I've never seen before. I haven't seen it either. Uh-oh. Thanks for diving into our movies with us. Don't miss Along for the Ride, only on Netflix.